Hello, I'm Ian Duddy, Chief Executive to the Scottish COVID-19 Inquiry. This is Scotland's biggest and most wide-ranging public inquiry as the pandemic had an impact on all our lives. This inquiry is examining how Scotland responded to the COVID-19 pandemic. We have produced a few short videos to answer commonly asked questions about how the inquiry works. While some of you will think of the oral evidence given at the inquiry's public hearings, this is only one of many sources of evidence that we use to investigate what happened during the pandemic. The inquiry also takes into account evidence from existing sources and gathers its own additional evidence as part of its investigations. The evidence can be classified into six main groups, from expert witnesses, voluntary and mandatory calls for evidence, witness testimony, academic research, and our listening project, Let's Be Heard. The inquiry has commissioned reports from independent experts who give their own professional opinion about what happened during the pandemic. Some expert witnesses may also be asked to give oral testimony at a public hearing. The inquiry has asked individuals and organisations to voluntarily provide documents and evidence under Rule 8 of the Inquiry's Scotland Rules of 2007. The inquiry has also served notices under Section 21 of the Inquiries Act of 2005. These are mandatory requests to individuals or organisations to provide relevant documents and evidence. In both cases, the evidence provided is analysed by the inquiry's legal team, is considered by the chair and may be referred to in witness testimony. The inquiry is taking witness statements from people and organisations. These statements may be published on the inquiry's website. Some witnesses will be asked to attend a public hearing to provide oral evidence based on their statement. Our hearings are chaired by Lord Brailsford, the inquiry's chair. In addition to the work carried out by the inquiry's own research team, the inquiry has commissioned external academic teams from across Scotland to carry out research into what happened during the pandemic. These commissioned reports are published on the inquiry's website. The inquiry's listening project, Let's Be Heard, is the main way in which people have contributed to the inquiry. Let's Be Heard aims to give a voice to as many people across Scotland as possible. We have asked the public to share their experiences of the pandemic and highlight any lessons they think that should be learned. More than 5,000 people shared their experiences with Let's Be Heard during its national engagement phase. These experiences will guide the inquiry's investigations and can help identify potential witnesses for our hearings. Let's Be Heard will publish a series of reports based on the experiences shared by the public in Scotland. The first report was published in November 2023.